So let's say you're on a par five. You hit your drive over here, kind of by the trees. You can't go up and over because the trees are too close. And if you hit the ball out sideways, what a lot of times that's your only option. But in this case, if I hit it out sideways, I'm giving up way too much yardage. I want to advance the ball. It's a par five. I want to advance the ball as far down there as I can so I have a shorter approach shot. So how do we play this shot? Well, what I'm going to do on this shot is I'm going to take a longer iron with a lot less loft and I'm going to punch a shot real low and straight down the fairway there to try to get me into a really nice position for my approach shot. So judging by the limbs on these trees and how much my ball is going to shoot up when I hit it, I'm going to go ahead and grab my four iron. And what I'm going to do with my four iron here is I'm not going to take a full swing. I, do, I don't need to hit a four, four iron the whole way. I, I want to put myself somewhere between 120 to a, or 100 to 120 out from the green. So I'm probably sitting at about two, 230 or so. So I don't want to get a lot of yards out of this thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a very short shot and I'm just going to let the momentum of the club go into the ball and keep it nice and low. I'm also going to put a little bit, try to put a little bit of a draw on this ball. So we just take it back real slow and just hit just like that. And that ball just took off, went right down to where I needed to be for my approach shot. Didn't have to worry about the tree limbs and I also didn't have to worry about giving up too much yardage by hitting it off to the side over here. So let's go up and take a look at how that shot set me up for my approach into the green on this par five. Okay, let's see what we're looking at here. Okay, I'm 106 yards out. I wanted to be between 100 and 120, and I got 106. So, we're gonna grab. <clears throat> so it's gotten, <laughs> it's gotten quite windy out here, and the wind keeps blowing my, my camera over. So let's try this again. Okay, so here we go. Let's see if we can't put one down there nice and close. That looks like it could be nice if it's enough. Oh yes, look at that kick, kicked right towards the flag. So having that specialty shot helped me hit the screen in regulation. Without it, I would have had to hit off to the side and I'd have a much longer shot in. So that putt came out pretty, or that uh, approach shot, looks like it came pretty close. Ooh, big bump, Ugh. big bump. Looks like I've got a nice look at birdie here. Let's see, come on out of here, grab my putter, my lovely Bionics, Bionic uh, RL Series 105 that I got from Amazon for dirt cheap. Yes, that shot turned out very nice. I'm very, very pleased with that. So the specialty shot helped me to come into this thing from a very short distance and hopefully I can just pop this in and have a merry little birdie. There you have it. On to the next hole.